Good morning, everybody. I just got to Table Rock in downtown Boise. I am gonna be doing a Saturday morning hike because um, this is 10 minutes from my house and it is Boise's pilgrimage hike. So if you haven't done the Table Rock hike in downtown Boise, today is your sign to get out and do that. But let's do Table Rock together. It is Saturday morning here in Boise, Idaho. It is beautiful, it is mid-April, and as you can see, the parking lot is super full. So if you're gonna be hiking, make sure you do get here pretty early on Saturdays as the parking lot does fill up. The hike to Table Rock does start at the Old Penitentiary Trailhead, and at the base, you can find the map that shows you all the routes you can take to get to the top. There are bathrooms down here, and there are also dog bags, so if you are bringing your pet, Make sure you grab a bag before heading up the trail. When you go up the initial trail, it does split into two separate trails. Don't worry though, both trails do lead to Table Rock. One is just a little bit steeper and I ended up taking the steeper route just because you do walk next to the Old State Penitentiary, which is right ahead of me in this video. As you can see, you have the Idaho State Penitentiary right there and then the Botanical Gardens is right there and then Table Rock is still clear up there, so we got a long ways to go. So Table Rock is just one of the amazing great hikes in downtown Boise. It's literally 10 minutes from my house. It's next to the Idaho State Penitentiary. It's next to the Botanical Gardens. And honestly, it's such an easy morning hike. And easy is a relative term, obviously, but it's easy to get here. It's you know, 45 minute loop if you're running or trail running. And then it's like an hour, hour and a half if you're walking up the mountain. So it's really a great morning hike in the summer or later afternoon hike in the spring and later fall because Idaho does get hot in the summer and you don't want to be up here, you know, 100 degree weather in July, but in May, which is when, is when I'm doing this right now, it's a great hike. The Table Rock hike is about 3.7 miles round trip with areas that do have moderate difficulty levels, so they are a little bit steeper, and it does have an elevation gain of around 900 feet. So make sure to wear comfortable hiking shoes, sunscreen, and a hat, and then layers are a good idea as well, as the weather can change quickly in the spring, summer, and fall, but it does get hot, so definitely wear sun protection. On your way to the top, there are all kinds of plaques that talk about the local wildlife, the Idaho State Penitentiary, and the area in general. Most people don't know that the iconic cross on the top of Table Rock was actually built in the 1950s by the Junior Chamber of Commerce in Boise, Idaho. The cross is visible from downtown Boise, and in the evenings it lights up. It's a gorgeous area to check out the Boise scenery and just stand at the top and enjoy the views. There's also the giant bee for Boise, obviously, at the top of Table Rock. Once you're at the top of Table Rock, you can actually walk around the cliff and there's all kinds of caves that are fun to explore as well. Hey everybody, I made it to the top. It took about 30 minutes and it was a 1.5 mile hike up. Never hiked Table Rock, you wouldn't know this, but there are also tons of other trails on Table Rock. So you can hike to the Old Rock Quarry, which is again, right above the Old State Penitentiary and the Tampa Gardens. And you can also mountain bike up here. So there's tons of really cool little mountain biking areas that segue off the main Table Rock Loop. So this is from the top of the Rock Quarry Loop. And as you can see, like I said, there are tons of little other trails that branch from the main area of Table Rock. So it is a really cool hike to do if you're in the area. Now, obviously the way down on Table Rock is much easier than the way up. Um, again, if you're running, it probably takes you 20 to 30 minutes to get to the top of Table Rock. If you're walking quickly like I did, it took 30 minutes. And if you're just leisurely strolling or walking pretty slow, it probably will take about 45 minutes to get to the top of Table Rock. And again, if it's a nice day like today, check out some of the other adjacent loops like the Rock Quarry Loop. Um, I actually ran out of time today, so I'm heading back down. But if you're up here and you got time, it's definitely something worth checking out. As you can see, Table Rock gets busy and it is a little steep on the downhill. So some people do use walking sticks if they feel like they're gonna be unstable, but so good I shoes are a must. So I finished hiking Table Rock. And if you can't tell, the parking lot has blown up. There are so many people here. It is full, it is overflowing. But honestly, it was a gorgeous morning, a great day to hike Table Rock. So if you're new to Boise or if you're looking for something to do, 
I definitely recommend this hike. It's one of my favorites. It's kind of the maiden voyage if you're moving here. So definitely come check out Table Rock. And if you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up. If you like my content and you want to see more of me, please subscribe. I'm an Idaho local uh, raised in Meridian. I've lived in Boise for the last decade. So thanks everybody for watching. See you in the next one.